my food is done hi guys welcome back to my vlog channel today we have a travel vlog so I'm going to be heading to the airport in about 30 minutes I am going to South Dakota I know you guys are probably like what why so I'm actually going and meeting the Nerdy Nuts team. I have been working with Nerdy Nuts for a while. You guys know I have my own peanut butter with them called Cookie Heaven. They're an amazing team, so sweet and kind, and they offered to bring me out to South Dakota, see the factory, have a meet and greet, go out to dinner, and just have a good time with the team. And they're also allowing me to bring my mom along for the ride. So I am so, so excited. I cannot wait to meet everyone and see how the peanut butter is made and vlog it all and just check out South Dakota. I never really thought to go there and they have Mount Rushmore there and I just am super excited because I love going to new states that I haven't been to. I would love to travel to every single state in the United States one day so I just can't wait to see South Dakota. So I just got done packing. I know I, I pack in the mornings. <laughs> I'm the most last minute packer there is, but we're only going for the weekend, so I don't need too much stuff, so I'm just bringing a carry-on. I'm gonna miss you girls. I'm gonna miss you guys. <laughs> oh, my little babies. Look how big Toffee is getting. Can you guys believe it? You're getting so big. Look how big she is. She is 10 pounds now. Such a sweet puppy, like so behaved, so sweet. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. They all get along so, so well. I know sometimes with like all girl dogs, you can have issues, but they all love each other so much. As you could have saw, they were they always cuddle in one bed together. Trust me, guys, I have multiple little dog beds for them, but they all like to be together. But yeah, she's getting so big. Still has a pink nose and beautiful green eyes she's just lovely and so are you guys so I'm having my friend stay in dog sit and house sit my house so they're gonna be with someone who they know and they're in great hands so that's what I typically do when I leave I just have a dog sitter come and stay here so that my dogs can be in their same environment and you know they're safe I packed very light I have some popcorn jeans a jacket so when we go see mount rushmore and go on tours i have a little jacket that's my bag full of toiletries and that's my makeup bag and then on the other side i literally just have four sweaters i'll open it so i have this tan one this really pretty like popcorn one striped and brown turtleneck so that's all I'm packing. I packed very light this time around, and I do need to fit some nicer shoes in here for when we all go out to dinner. So I think I'm gonna just bring these black booties. I'm also going to wear just my brown Uggs to the airport. I love this suitcase. I got it from Amazon. I will link it in my storefront in the travel section, but it's super small and easy to carry, and then it also wheels all directions, so you can walk to the airport with it very easily. And it also has a code so you can lock it. Let's see, can we get these in here, guys? <laughs> they always are just standing inside of my suitcase. I know you wanna come, don't you? Trust me, I would bring you guys if I could. Hi, you wagging your tail. She's like, take me with you. Okay, excuse me, Mochi. Excuse me, Toffee. Okay, I think I have a, oh wait, one more thing. We need contacts, toothbrush, which I hope my mom has toothpaste because I don't have a little miniature one to bring. And then my hairbrush. So let's just put these in here somewhere. <laughs> if I can get in here, guys. There's always like one thing I end up forgetting. And it's always as soon as you leave and you start driving away, you're like, shoot, I forgot this. And I forgot this. So hopefully I have everything. But if not, usually my mom has, she's a good packer, so she'll have stuff too but we can always buy something too in the hotel if we need it all right got my shoes in here let's shut this and see if it fits and then I'll put my laptop in here as well and edit a video on the airplane so our first stop is Denver Colorado we don't have a straight flight and then I don't know how long that flight is it's probably like two and a half hours three hours not too long at all and then I believe from there to South Dakota, it's like a 45 minute flight, so. 
super easy travel day. So here's my airport fit. I have this comfort hoodie on. These are so comfy. I've been wearing it like every day. For Christmas, I got my brother this one with the matching sweatpants. I just know he's gonna love it. And then some leggings, and I'm just gonna, gonna wear my brown Ugg boots. So I'm heating up some leftovers. Look how much is still left over, and I already put some in the microwave. So this was my dinner from last night, and the meal was huge. It was like a chicken parmesan as big as my plate, and then probably like a whole entire box of fettuccine. So this is what I heated up. I'm just gonna eat this and then head to the airport. We made it to South Dakota. So we got in really late last night and we ended up just stopping over at a pub and we got some like bar appetizers. We came back, went to sleep, and then today we woke up at like seven and got ready for the day. We went down and got some Starbucks. I got an brown sugar shaken oat milk espresso. My mom got a medicine ball, I think. It's, they just called it a citrus honey tea or something. But we're about to head to breakfast before we go to the Nerdy Nuts warehouse. We are so excited to see the behind the scenes. But here is my outfit. Top is from Pink Lily, so comfy. I got this in pink and this brown color because I love it. And then these jeans are also Pink Lily. <laughs> Code PAPIS20 for a discount. Their jeans are just so comfy. And then I think I'm just gonna wear my brown Ugg boots with this because I only brought those or my black heels, which I think those are gonna be for dinner tonight. Mom, outfits. We're both short. Very short. <laughs> um, Target jeans, Walmart boots, Old Navy vest, TJ Maxx. Cute. <laughs> <laughs> so I got ready in this bathroom, but we are hungry. So we are going to go stop by at this breakfast spot right across the street. Few people have told us to go here. South Dakota is a very small town, so I feel like everyone kind of goes to the same spots and someone on the plane told us to go here our friends at nerdy nuts told us to go here and i think someone last night too so we're gonna walk over there and check it out just made it to the nerdy nuts factory oh my gosh it's so cute guys look at this they have all the balloons outside so here's like their fun experience room and you walk in and you can make your own peanut butters. You can come right here and spin the wheel, which is so fun. You make something good. Honey sweet. Cute. Making a new one. Let's see, so pick a jar. So over here you have all your different nuts, fresh peanut butter. There's butterscotch, white chocolate, dark chocolate, so many toppings. And then there's even so many over here. How fun is that? You can really get creative. So, what should I do this time around? I love caramel. I've never tried the vanilla. Maybe I'll do like a vanilla chocolate chip. We're gonna try the vanilla sauce. I did caramel last time, but we'll try vanilla. Can't go wrong with vanilla, right? Dad's favorite. Yeah. We'll do white chocolate. I, I, I Look how satisfying this is when it comes out. Fresh peanut butter. Oh. Straight from the nut. <laughs> Straight from the nerdy nut. <laughs> and then you tap it down a little. We'll do a little more. You can mix them. Yeah. Do like white and milk. Okay, With now. Come over to the topping station. We'll do some white chocolate chips. Gorgeous. And some toffee from my dog. Lots of toffee. And then let's do some more peanut butter. Mix with vanilla and milk. That's a pretty one. She did this whole video. Oh, yeah. Chocolate chips in with the nuts. That's cool. It's like a, a twist. And I think we'll top it off with some mellow cream. Maybe Swirl. some mini marshmallows. Marshmallows? Mm hmm. Oh, they have chocolate marshmallows. Like hot cocoa. <gasps> That's oh, what I'm gonna make a hot cocoa one. They're dehydrated. That's how yeah, they stay. Yeah, I'm gonna make a hot cocoa one. 
So this yep. is like a twist cone, milk chocolate vanilla. What should I name this one? White choco hot cocoa. White choc White. cocoa. I'm gonna make a hot cocoa. It's like a dark chocolate on the bottom. Okay. And now I'm gonna use some white chocolate to go with it. It's gluten free too. <laughs> we have Oreos. Oh, these sea salt caramel truffles are so good. That's what's in Cookie Heaven. We're gonna do both. Huh? Ooh. My jars are getting labels. We just sealed them so I can bring them home with me. And then they have it so cute in here where you can design your label over here. Color and add stickers. That's cute. Yeah, Christmassy. Oh my gosh. Nerdy Nuts couldn't get any cooler. <laughs> they have a Minecraft game back here. We're about to play Dungeons. While the team is making peanut butter down there. <laughs> We're up here having fun. Oh, there you go. It's like we're Dave and Buster. But with limited plates. I need one of these. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Can I order one of these on Amazon? Oh, you can. Scan it and go. I need a somersault. You might like that. I don't even know where I need it. Oh, man. I'm a guy. Look how cute all the wall art is in here. It's all the characters on the labels. There's all the jars. And guys, look, we sold Cookie Heaven. Like all of those. There it is. There's Mount Rushmore. Wow, let's zoom in. That's pretty cool. Did you guys know that they were supposed to have bodies but the heads took too long? So they didn't get to that? But the blueprint, they had bodies. Did you know that? You told me that. You did tell me that recently. Pretty cool. I really wanted to see this. It's like pretty big. It's big, but I actually pictured it to be bigger. Yeah, we were thinking it would be like, we were like driving and she saw it on the mountain. I wouldn't have even noticed it honestly because, yeah, if you weren't like looking for it because the whole mountain is so big and it's just like in like the tiny little George Washington crevice. Stands out though. Yeah, George is in the front. The other ones are like tucked yeah. away. All right, we just pulled over to stop at Rushmore Candy Company. I saw this online that this was one of the top 10 things to do here. So let's go check it out. The building is really cool. Look at the little ice cream cones outside, but look at this guys, it's like mountains. I have not been to a place like this, like you'll be driving and there's nothing and then there's just a random Christmas store or a random candy store, like it's just so random. The candy shop had a ton of taffy and a ton of stuff, like so much stuff. The place was like empty, it's just like yeah. so weird, but we got this bacon ranch popcorn. Let's give it a try and see if it's good. So we're hungry. What do you think? Mmm, good. Mm. It's good. Pretty good. Cheesy. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Monday we're open 10 to 15. Okay. It could be our snack tonight after dinner. It is the next day. Last night we met up with the Nerdy Nuts team and got some dinner at the rooftop of our hotel. It was delicious. I got a steak with some garlic mashed potatoes and then we split a charcuterie board. It was so, so good and we had a lot of fun. And then after, we came back up and pretty much went to sleep. But today we're up nice and early and we're gonna go check out some landmarks that are in South Dakota. Our plan is to go to the Badlands and the Spearfish Canyon. I'm not really too sure. I looked it up and there's only like a few TikToks of each place. So I don't know, we'll check it out for ourselves. On our way to the Badlands. It's about an hour away and we have not passed a single car. Well, maybe <laughs> six cars and a bunch there's... of black cows. <laughs> <laughs> it's like we're on a different you can planet. Survive on milk if that's uh, <laughs> stranded out here. And we got the gingerbread latte, and we each got a sandwich too. Since we're not sure when we're gonna see another yeah, place to eat. Nothing in sight. <laughs> <other than> land. <laughs> 
made it to Mars. <laughs> Look at the this. Badlands. Pretty cool. So you can do a little hike up it. So we're gonna check that out. I just really wanna feel one of these things. Like it looks like a big mound of dirt. I wanna feel it. Yeah, when you're walking down it, it feel weird? Ugh. Like, it feels like weird. Sand. Yeah, it's like squishy, squishy rock. Oh, wow. And it says, beware of the rattlesnakes. Ooh. <gasps> <laughs> I want to go all the way up there. Huh? Let's just go to that tip. It's cool up here. Whew, I'm out of breath. I'm also not in the right shoes, I'll tell you that. I'm in Ugg boots, walking on gravel. <laughs> I already slipped. <laughs> oh my god, you can go down, you can go up the fucking hill. I know. I know. Oh Sit on your butt. Sit on your butt. <laughs> okay. Are you gonna walk now? No. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna. Is it slippery? Yeah, just like take. Walk on your heels. Be careful, because there's a cliff. I know. <laughs> Jim, oh my god. Just slide. Just slide down at this point. Yeah, we're not in the, the right attire for this. We weren't really sure what we were expecting. But also, we packed super small suitcases. So I wouldn't have even been able to bring hiking boots. Whew. Wait, is it not a slippery over here? No, it gets better. Just walk with your heel. Like dig your heel in when you're going downhill. We just had the best dinner ever. Here's our leftovers. Vodka noki and pesto noki. Each of our leftovers. Oh my god, it was so good. We got some gelato, salted caramel, and pistachio. How is it? Very good. This place is super cute. Well guys, it is the end of the night. We are so, so tired. I think the time change is kinda catching up to us tonight, but we fly home tomorrow morning and we're both ready to go home, but we had a blast and it was definitely very cool seeing South Dakota. And thank you Andrea and Erica from Nerdy Nuts for inviting us out here for an amazing time. It was so nice meeting you guys. And the company is so sweet and it was so cool to see the behind the scenes. Definitely something I will remember forever. Thank you all so much for watching this vlog and I will see you back in Ohio. Bye guys.